So when me, uh, Mark, and Richard came up, we came up the other this way, and this is as far as we could. This is as far as we got because it was shut because of snow. So then we had to go. We had to go all the way back down, so he never got to do that, so that's a first for me. It was, it was good, wasn't it? So we've just had a little lunch stop. Down the bottom there, not that you can see. Very nice. I had some local cheese on my panini. And now we're just heading off. This is the Col de Aspin. So it's not as high as the Col de Tormel, obviously, because that's the highest one. But it appears that these cyclists go up both of them. Mad. And uh, they, well not so far, but there's lots of gravel shit on the road. So when we were coming up before the lunch stop, it was, they just like loose gravel everywhere. It was like brilliant. You sort of hit a big pile of it. And it's all in these squares. I think they just wait for it to, for the people to crash. <laughs> Or disperse on it. <laughs> so you're never sure these little grey patches, whether they're older ones with no gravel on or a new one with gravel on. You don't want to be doing that on these corners. Like the summit here. Look at that. We're going down that road all the way down there. guardrail and when you do that it's uh you see the edge <laughs> get that little butterfly in your stomach my missus will love this she's scared of heights <laughs>
tractor causing a bit of chaos there. <laughs> I think he's going to be coming up. Trouble if you had two of those meeting each other, wouldn't you?
It's a big mistake for a good damn boy like me You know, hey, I'm out of this You took my loneliness away I'm not again You know, hey Took my loneliness away I'm not okay